morning and welcome to Conception Seminary College. If you've ever wondered what a seminarian does on a daily basis, you've come to the right place. I'll be showing you guys what I do on a daily basis and yeah, I guess we'll just see where it goes. Let's roll. Prayer is by far the best way to start the day, so I usually like to get to the oratory around 5.30 to get some personal prayer in before we pray the liturgy of the hours as a group at 6.45. seminary prayer is by far the most important because as seminarians and as God willing priests our number one goal is to imitate Christ and prayer just allows us to get to know who he is so this next hour for me is crucial because I simply just get to talk to him and get to know him and it's also where I get my strength to handle whatever the day throws at me So one staple of seminary life is praying the Liturgy of the Hours as a community. A few minutes will be 6.45, so we'll do Office of Readings, followed by a 45-minute meditation period, and then we'll finish strong with some morning prayer. So right now is grind time. I don't have class for another hour. So I usually like to take this time to just knock out any homework I have. So let's do that. It's about 9.20, so I gotta start heading over to my first class of the day, which is philosophy of human nature. Academics is a huge part of seminary because I mean you got to have smart priests so in college seminary you study philosophy which is actually pretty hard at first but once you start to understand it a little bit it's super sweet time for classe de espanol that means Spanish class Hola. <laughs> right now is by far the pinnacle of the day because right now is mass and it's so important as a seminarian to know Christ and there's no really better way to do that than to receive him in the Eucharist here at, at mass. So let's go do that. So now that we've received the Eucharist, it's time for lunch. It's Monday, so we usually have about a 20 ounce sirloin steak. I'm kidding. That'd be sweet though. The time has come, ladies and gentlemen. 
last class of the day. So right now I have about an hour of free time. And here a guy can really do whatever he wants. You could take a nap, you could read a book, you could do more homework. Um, me and some of the guys actually are planning on going down to the Union to play a game called Jungle Pong. So let's do that. We're about to play Jungle Pong, which is basically in short, you just gotta see it. <laughs> Whoa! So I have a little bit more free time, so I thought I'd talk about conception itself a little bit more. Um, one thing that's kind of cool about conception is it's attached to a Benedictine monastery, and the primary ministry of this monastery is to run the seminary. So. A lot of our formators are monks. A lot of our professors are monks. Um, we have spiritual direction meetings and chaplain meetings. And chaplain meetings are like talking about human formation, how to grow as a, as a man. And my spiritual director, chaplain, are both monks. And so we really get to be immersed in monastic life, which is really cool and get to know these guys. And they're super cool guys. And so I thought since I have a little bit more free time, we can meet one of them. Just Boom! <laughs> This is the freshman and sophomore chaplain, Father Etienne, and so he's actually my chaplain. And every other Thursday, I have a chaplain meeting with him, and then on off Thursdays, I have spiritual direction. But Father, the world is just waiting to hear. What is the best part about being a chaplain at a seminary? Yeah, sure. So I think the best part of me being a chaplain in the seminary is I get to be a father to these men, and hopefully through my witness and my uh, life that they can grow uh, and mature to become uh, fathers themselves. Mm. Amen. All right, so next up on the agenda is team sports. And team sports is basically when the freshmen and the sophomores get together for about an hour on Mondays and Wednesdays to play a competitive sport. I think today's indoor soccer, and that one usually gets pretty intense. cleaned up, hair's looking good, time for evening prayer. pretty special about conception is that three nights out of the week and then Sunday afternoons we have weighted meals meaning that every week different seminarians are chosen to to be servers and so this week is my week and it's a great time to just serve serve my fellow brothers Time to relax. Just getting time to work out the boys! So one way we usually attack our workouts is we really look at it as a powerful form of prayer. And so every time we come in, we always offer our workout up for an intention. We say a prayer, and then throughout our workout, we always remember that intention. Um, and it's a way for us to really unite our suffering while we're working out with the with the cross of Christ And so that's kind of a beautiful powerful form of prayer. So Let's do it boys. Yes, sir. Let's, let's do it
All right, so now it's time to start winding down. And one way I do that is I always look over my notes for like 10 minutes just to uh, stay sharp with whatever we're learning. And now we finish this day how we started it. Prayer. Alrighty, well that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I just want to say that if God is calling you to the seminary, say yes, because it's hands down the best decision you could ever make in your life. Um, it's really changed mine. So I'll be praying for you guys. And yeah, I'm exhausted. So I'm gonna hit the hay. Good night. Take it easy.